My reason for having just come from uh, Los Angeles, and had I, uh, if this meeting had taken place four days ago, we perhaps would have had a different approach, but the same subject, was the brutal murder that took place in Los Angeles Friday night of a black man. I won't say a Muslim, because you, the white press wants to blow up the fact that it was a Muslim in an effort to alienate him from the, what they call the Negro masses. This was a so-called Negro that was shot down. Not one, but seven of them in cold blood by the police. And any time some white liberal wants to jump up in my face and tell me something about the Gestapo tactics that are practiced in Nazi Germany, I'll bust you in your mouth. Get that just please. I don't want to hear that. Will you cut that out, please? If, you, if in the same breath you can't describe the Gestapo tactics that are practiced in Nazi America, against black people in this country, day in and day out, north, south, east, and west, you shouldn't open up your white mouth about Germany or South Africa or Portugal or any other country on this earth. The Los Angeles Police Department, for the past five days, have used America's press, meaning the radio, the television, the newspaper to cover up one of the worst crimes, one of the most inhuman acts of atrocity that have ever been committed in a civilized society or in a so-called civilized society. And this Gestapo-type action is a crime not only against black people, it's a crime against society, people who call themselves civilized, it's a crime against people who call themselves religious, and it's a crime against people who call themselves God-fearing. In America, as black people, we haven't seen any religious white people. In America, as black people, we haven't seen any God-fearing white people. Harrington, the man whose name you just called out as a Christian preacher and, and, and classified as a white liberal, he doesn't want us in there because he knows he can't close our mouth when it comes to pointing out in an uncompromising way the treatment of black people in America, not at the hands of Nazis, not at the ha hands of Germans, but at the hands of white people who call themselves Christians, at the hands of white people who call themselves... And because these, and because these, these criminals in Los Angeles wore police uniforms, it didn't make their criminal acts any more so right than the uniform.